Hey everybody, it's Marty from Aspect LED. I often get asked, hey Marty, how do you install a puck light? Well today we're going to demonstrate how, so let's go ahead and open up the box and show you what's inside. The contents of the box are the light, which comes with a power cord attached, two little screws that we're going to use for mounting, and this additional cord. This can be plugged in here for additional length, or you can cut this end off. The screws will be used on the back side when this is mounted. For the installation today, here is everything that you will need. We also have a list in the description. These puck lights are meant to be surface mounted meaning you do not have to cut a recessed hole for these, they just mount on the surface. When you look at it though, you may not notice that it actually is, comes in two pieces. To separate them out, simply gra grab the ring and push this out right here. That separates the mounting ring from the body of the light. If you look at this now, you can see that there's two mounting locations. You're going to take this and attach it to the bottom of the cabinet. You also have two options when you're running the power. You can either drill the power up into the cabinet to contain your power supply there, or you can surface mount your wires, and in that case, you'll be running the wire through this notch here. Now that we have the puck lights mounted, let's talk about the power wires. These come in either 12 or 24 volt DC. They can't go directly to the AC. They do need a power supply. If you want to check out our video on power supplies, you can check that out here. But let's talk about this connector right here. This connector that connects here allows you to add additional length if you need it with this specific type of plug. But if you have a situation like ours where you don't need this, you can simply cut it off. Now that we've cut off that connector, you can see that I have two wires here. I have the black wire with the minus sign on it, and the other wire with some lettering on it. The black wire, or the wire with the black line and the minus line is going to your black negative wire, and the other wire is going to go to the red positive wire. So let's separate these out and splice them. We hope you found this video helpful. If you'd like more information about the puck light options, check out this video here. For more helpful videos, please like and subscribe.